are you? Good morning. This is Irene with Yummy Life with Irene. Uh, guys, welcome back for another new video. And uh, if this is your first time here, hmm, my dear, have a seat. Enjoy the show because we have really amazing videos and uh, join the Yummy Life family. And if you are my returning subscriber, thank you so, so much. I am, I don't know, I am just you know, I'm grateful to God. It is by God's mercy that you people get to watch my videos. Because uh, I don't make these videos for anybody. But uh, you guys have become a part of my YouTube family. So for that, blessings. And guys, today, uh, this video, I, I wanted to make it a bit later. Like uh, in a month's time. Because I usually slot my videos in a period of a month. But uh, because of your response on the previous video that we did for making, the one that we did for making uh, shower gels, you know, I told you guys that this thing can be a business plug. And uh, literally, I, I didn't know I was making such an impact. And uh, I have so much feedback that people are loving this and they are going to do it as a business. So I decided why not make this video uh, so that people can have something, you know, uh, me being, uh, you know, surviving on one income is not easy. So you really need all channels, you know, this channel, this one, this one, this one to bring in money. So I decided, let me make this video for all the people who called me, others who sent their messages in the, in the description box, guys, this is for you. This is another thing that you can, you know, you can do business with. So today, guys, I'm going to teach you how to make multi-purpose detergent, yeah? And uh, guys, I want to prep up a bit because of my dress. When you're making these detergents, they can uh, literally <laughs> mess your clothes. So it's good to sometimes to wear an apron or just uh, take care of yourself with a, with a lesson like me. I usually find aprons better for cooking. So I'm ready, guys. So let us make these. Uh, guys, my products are still from the same person. Uh, that is Chem Station Enterprises. And uh, if this is your first time on my show, guys, watch my videos. I have videos for making uh, shower gel, uh, fabric softener, I have videos for making antiseptic, you know, multi-purpose antiseptic. I have videos for making bleach. Guys, watch them. They are up here. I have quite a number of videos. You can watch them and they will help you. Chem Station uh, is still at OTC stage behind Equity Bank. Uh, there's, a, there's a like a small route there, a footpath that uh, when you enter the footpath from the side of the uh, quick mat uh, supermarket, you will see it. It's just written in bold letters, Chem Station Enterprises, it's on the first floor. So guys, get your products. They just go and tell them Irene has sent you and you want to know, you want to get these products. And if my video doesn't explain better, just tell them how to tell you how to mix. This is how they do it, guys. Uh, you see like this product, they have written number one. I have another product written number one. You know, they'll tell you when they write for you number one, you know you're supposed to mix all the number ones together. Then from there you go to number two. From there you go to number three after mixing. So guys, let's do this. Uh, so we are going to open our products. And always guys, make sure you have a, a dustbin nearby because these are not products that you want to keep down. Make sure you get everything. Yeah. So we do the other products. And always make sure that the basin that you're using or the container that you're using to make your product 
is very clean because this one will make you get a very clean product that doesn't have debris so the other number one is here so you're all going to put all the number ones at once this is also another number one Make sure you discard the staples. Just to be on the safe side, you can use uh, a universal or a chemical mask. But I've made these products for so many years. There are only two products, but I feel like I, I really want to wear a chemical mask. And that is the toilet cleaner because those, that one gives a lot of fumes and it's a video coming up make sure you get rid of all the staples so this is our last number one product mix this one thing I'll say when you're making uh, like the multi-purpose detergent you really need a big big container uh, my capacity the one I'm making for today is 10 liters so you have a container that will hold 10 liters of water maybe like 20 so that you have space to really mix your products, you need to put some elbow grease and make sure that you mix all these products very well. Then uh, what you're going to do, you're going to, to take five liters of water first. So I have, I have uh, jerry cans here for a capacity of five liters. Oh. For the detergent, I usually find it easier first to mix 5 liters of water first before I put the other 5 liters. And this makes sure that I get a, a very smooth detergent. So make sure you're scraping your bottom. So that you're able to dissolve everything. So we mix this. Make sure you have your clean cloth around. You stir it clockwise, anti-clockwise. 
you know you just want to get everything dissolved in the five liters of water before we add our another our, our other five liters much as I'm stirring, I can feel, still feel that the salt has not dissolved very well, the industrial salt. So you're supposed to stir this until you can't see any particles. This still has a lot of particles. I'm not seeing any of my seeds. Guys, this is a very, very economical product to make at home because like making a capacity of uh, 10 liters of detergent, I usually make 20 liters and I made half of the 10 liters yesterday because I wanted to have a finished product to show you. Uh, the 20 liters. I bought the products at uh, five Kenya, 500 Kenya shillings. That's like a dollar, uh, four dollars fifty, four dollars thirty there. So it's a very, very economical product to make. So it's dissolving very well, but just be patient. If you're patient, you're going to get a very, very well mixed detergent it's going to be creamy and thick and it won't have uh, particles inside because you mixed it very well so if for 500 kenya shillings you're going to get 20 liters of detergent it's worth it and there are times sometimes you will stir it and uh, after giving it time, the 24 hours, a whole day, to settle down, you will find it is really thick. So sometimes you get 22 liters out of the 20, or sometimes even 23 liters of very thick, very thick detergent. So... And the good thing is uh, it's a multi-purpose detergent. So you, 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 I usually use it to wash clothes with my machine. I also use it to wash my toilets, you know, scrub the floors. Yeah. It's a really, really versatile uh, product. To have in the house you know the uses are many like to mop my house and the floors i usually use my detergent and also i put a cup of two of my antiseptic the one i made and that makes my house smell really nice still feel some salt so I'll continue stirring don't be in a rush just be patient when the foam for
forms on top like this, you will know you're doing a good job. You're on the right uh, path. Guys, I have a surprise that is, uh, you know, cooking. <laughs> and uh, all I can say is that uh, thank you, guys. <laughs> thank you so much for your subscription. It's taking me somewhere. When I started YouTube, it was all about sharing and uh, helping somebody out there. And now it's still all about sharing. And guys, I'm on my way to a thousand subscribers. And I know to some people that's not much. But to me, you know, even to have 500 people sit down and watch and subscribe to you is no mean feat, believe you me. YouTube is not easy. It's really time consuming. You have to remain consistent. So guys, continue subscribing, continue sharing, and uh, have a surprise for a, a, a number of you. I'm going to, you're going to do a raffle from my subscribers and uh, when we get to a thousand subscribers, for every a hundred people, I'm going to pick one person to come and have lunch in my house. So out of the a thousand subscribers, 10 of you lucky ones will have an opportunity to come and uh, have lunch, dinner, yeah, in my house. I'm going to make uh, all your favorite dishes. Just a way of saying thank you. So guys, I don't take this, uh, you know, I don't take it easy and I don't uh, take it for granted that you people sit down and watch my videos. I'm really, really, really overwhelmed by your love, by your comments, you know. So that will be a way of me saying thank you. Ah, our product is well mixed now. So I'm going to add the other five liters of water to make the total to be 10 liters. So we make sure that uh, the ten, the five liters we've added is mixed inside. You can see it's becoming thick, thick as I'm stirring. So we mix the other ten liters. And the moment we have added the other five liters, or the five liters, guys. becoming thick and thick yeah, 
you can see how thick it is and it's still going to get thick so from here uh, you choose the color that you want and uh, I don't know I don't like uh, green or blue because it's a very monotonous color everybody makes green or blue so I like being a bit unique and uh, for that I'm going to use a cherry color And uh, you just put a bit, you don't put a lot. Remember guys, this is a universal color. And uh, the universal color, what, once it sits and settles, it becomes very, very thick. So we mix the color. Make sure everything is well mixed. You can see, guys, how thick it is. So from here, when I'm doing, I love uh, a perfume called Chantal. And uh, Chantal, wow. I love using Chantal because I find it's a unique scent. Guys, when you're buying the products, they come with uh, one package of perfume. But because this is my own home use product, I like doing a double of the perfume. So we're going to mix this. Oof. That smell of Chantal is just amazing. So when you go to chem station, it's you to choose the color that you want and the, and the scent also, the perfume that you want. So you can go according to your preference. You can do a uh, purple and uh, maybe do the lavender perfume. You can do a Chantel like mine. You know, there are so many. There's Jojoba also. And the good thing with the Jojoba, you can still use uh, a different color. You know, it's all according to your preference of what perfume you want. So guys, our product is ready. So this is ready to sit somewhere out of reach uh, for about a whole day. Uh, usually by 12 hours, it's okay. But I like doing it, I like giving it more time because it gives me a, a thicker product. The more you let it sit, the better it becomes. So guys, I made 10 liters of uh, the same, same uh, cherry and uh, Chantel uh, multipurpose detergent. And I want to show you how it is. So guys, see you in a minute. Guys, we are back. And uh, I'm 
want to show you the one that I made yesterday so that you can see how your product is going to look. These are settled for a, a whole day, that is 24 hours. And guys, look at the color. And also, look at how thick it is. And it smells amazing. So guys, our product is ready for packaging. And uh, I want us to do packaging together so that you see how I store mine. And there are so, so many packaging options. The same, same area in OTC, you'll find uh, the people who sell plastic bottles. So if you're doing this for business, you have an option just down there. Next to Equity Bank, you'll find some people selling very nice bottles if you're going to do this for business. So you are able to, you know, display your product better. So this is my 10 liters of uh, detergent storage. So using a funnel, I just to sew this product together so that you see how good it is. You can see guys how thick it is. So this is 10 liters. And uh, I'm sorry, guys, you know, <laughs> Kenya power. Hey, you can do, you can do us sometimes, you know, you can do us bad. When I was shooting the video, mid video, <laughs> the lights went off, you know, and they've just come back. So forgive me if you find parts of this video a bit dark. You know, there are things that are just out of our, our control. But thanks, guys, for being understanding. So my product will take me another five, six months. So the next time I'm making a detergent in this house for my home use is going to be 2023 by God's grace. So guys, thank you. Thank you so much. So this has totally filled my 10 liters. So I want to wipe this. And uh, I want to show you if you stir well your product, it does not have residue. So guys, you can see. still has some space you can see guys the basin it doesn't have any residue so i scrape this so there's no waste what I'm going to do is I'm going to rinse my basin with some water and load it in my machine. It will be enough detergent to start my clothes tomorrow. So guys, here is our 10 liters of detergent and uh, you're set. You haven't 
spent so much you have really saved so guys let's make the products you know let's save save because uh, i believe any coin that you save somewhere else it will work well somewhere else and guys thank you for watching this video thank you for being with me and uh see you guys in the next video and much love from my house to yours bye guys see you